to my right, repping Boston. <laughs> It's 40 Bars. I'm out here in Boston, repping my city, repping the brand, queen in the ring. Shout out Vague, Debo, Babs. I love y'all. See y'all. Boston, we in here. Shark Tank Battlegrounds, Raw Time Radio. Know what it is. No team, I bust by myself like I masturbated. Oh. Oh. Yo, what up, 40 Bars? We in Boston. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see the big homie came out, man. We out here. Boston. <laughs> we doing it, 40, man. They haven't seen you since the um, you, you first Star Smiles, man. What's going on, man? Talk to the people. Getting ready, I'm getting ready for, you know what I'm saying? My mixtape's supposed to be dropping mid-May, Kaleidoscope. Um, I ain't been doing shit, just writing and working and shit, writing, writing. Right, okay. For my next battle. Well, how, how do you feel about that battle with you and Star Smiles, man? Like you always say, I'm gonna keep it a thousand. I'm gonna keep it a thousand. Um, I won. It is what it is. Like, I'm saying Star did her thing, not to take nothing from her. Star definitely did her thing. I think I bring the best out of people. Like I think that was Star's best performance, but I don't think she had enough for me that day. Okay, okay, okay. So you know, how do you feel? You know, the transition coming to Queen of the Ring, finally being in that ring. How did how how did it make you feel the whole experience all together? It was definitely it was definitely a good feeling for me. It was like you know a chance at redemption since I um, fucked up in a spawn session and all that. Like when I got back in the ring, it was. It was a must that I, you know what I'm saying, I did what I had to do. Yeah, that's one thing, that's one thing I do like about you, you know, you, you do keep it 100. You know, you was real critical about yourself, about, you know, the sparring session and shit like that. Yeah, a lot good. of people say even though you fucked up, you still won. A couple know. people said that, like, I, I'm, I'm one of those people, like, I read all the comments on the battles, like, you know what I'm saying, I keep up with what the fans are saying, and um, a lot of people did say that I won, a lot of people said I did good despite the slip, but I don't I don't settle for you did good, but like if people put a butt after, you know what I'm saying, they said you did good and you really didn't do that good, so here's that's a, why I was star, I'm confident that I won. Here's a question for you. Mm -hmm. For all the dudes that got the lotion on the side watching the 40 bar battle. <laughs> You know? Stop it. I love y'all as people. That's it. Stop it. You know? <laughs> you, you know, they, they thinking 40 bars wake up with, with a skirt, boots, high heels and all that, makeup on the face every day, going out, you know? Nah, I'm not even like a, like, I come to the ring granted, like, I'm gonna be on camera, so I wanna look nice, like, I'm saying, like, I'm more feminine than not, but I'm regular every day, like, I'm in sweats and t-shirts and scarves and shit. So you were you, you down to earth, shorty, yeah? Very much so, like, I don't know. A lot of people got me fucked up, I think, because um, I wear dresses and shit like that to the battles, or... Uh, <laughs> nah, I just... I mean, I like looking nice like anybody else, but... So I know you're gonna I'm come not out... Chrissy, bitch, and I like that. Okay, I know you're gonna come out with Kaleidoscope, you know, your mixtape and all that, you know, like, where you... You know, we, we in Boston right now, man. Speak for your home. You know, we finally here. Boston, 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 Boston. <laughs> We in Dorchester, we just left Common Square, we're going out Center Street. I'm from Mattapan, by the way, just to make it official and all that, but um, I guess Dorchester, Roxbury, Mattapan, those are, I guess, our boroughs the Boston. Um, oh no, I can't leave out High Park, Roslindale, JP. Those are all smaller, like, towns. Everything kind of bleeds into each other, though, like I was telling people. You don't so, have to get on, like, the, what is that, the FDR, whatever that's called. 
a bad way, but it's just not to move. You was born out here, 40? Yes, sir. Oh, this is the jail right here, South Bay. South Bay. Shout out to all my niggas under the under the wall. Ain't no Rikers, but they but they ain't no life. You know, so. South Bay. I'm gonna keep it a thousand. Boston's not really a, a hip hop friendly city. I'm not gonna do the race thing and say it's the LA people. This, I'm not gonna do all that. But our city's a, a commonwealth. Like they don't really see. These are the dope houses, and that's what boy. I go back right comes to life. It's crazy. Like we got. Nice, nice houses and then fucked up houses right around the corner from them. Like, it's, it's all crazy, but... Um, the hip-hop scene here is kind of... It's growing, I'll say that. Especially, like, the battle scene. Like, we don't... We just... The only league we have out here is Shark Tank Battle Leagues. Um, shout out Chilla. Um, Grind Time, I came out here for a little while, but, you know, that died. So, we really don't have too many outlets for, you know us to be you know seen out here but we're definitely working on like there's a lot of a lot of us are making these out of town trips these out of state battles using it as a platform to put our city on our cell phone you know it's really not a misconception that boston's like ganged up like it really is like that like this street don't fuck with this street right here bro like it, it's it's crazy but i think that is definitely the biggest barrier like that's the biggest reason why we can't really grow as a city because talent is definitely not the issue you know what i mean we have um so many different groups of people and if one group don't fuck with another group or you're from this set my niggas don't fuck with this set or they don't fuck with this then not even set because that's not we just say hood basically because it's really street gangs like we don't bang colors and nothing like that it's really where you grew up so if niggas don't fuck with you from this neighborhood, then niggas ain't gonna buy your CDs. Niggas ain't gonna push your shit. If they gotta connect at the radio station, nigga, they're not playing. You know what I mean? So, so you gotta know somebody to know somebody. Hell yeah, and if and you better make sure motherfuckers don't know you too much because they might not fuck with you. And so it's crazy. It's crazy. In Boston, it, it's so small. Like, it's a good thing and it's a bad thing. Like, an artist can have the opportunity to own Boston. Really though, like really, really, really own Boston if they're a neutral artist as far as um, where they came from or you know what I'm saying shit like that not even saying like they don't get it in but as far as like they don't have like no no heavy no heavy affiliation mm -hmm. but they still fuck with or they just neutral if they're not like a, a flip flop or things like that I right. said flip flop or like bad girls club I be watching it so out of state I'm out of place bitch we could do it here Babs, how this bitch get in a circle? She too square. Oh. You ain't never popped off, got loose or cut shit. I'm a real dyke. I keep a long pipe, but I fuck shit. So right now you got, you know, shout out to Shark Tank. You got Chilla Jones. He's doing it, you know, on the URL vibe. And then you out here doing it for the Queen of the Ring vibe. You know, does it, is it a good look for Boston all together? Like, yeah, it's kind of putting attention back to where you know where it's supposed to be. Hell oh, yeah, it's definitely a good look. Like Chill is doing his thing. He just did his thing on the main stage. I'm holding Queen of the Ring down. We got Philly, Hazy, Flames. They doing a the King of the Ring thing and other little um, leagues, Block City, Boston All Star. Shout out all of them. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like they all trying to do their thing for the city right now. So Boston's in a transition period from from being underrated to on the map. Now, big question. We ain't, we ain't got a tentative date yet, but, you know, I heard you got somebody. Who, who's your next opponent, man, that you gonna go in that me. ring with? Huh? Somebody wanted me. Okay. Wanted me. Somebody wanted me. So. Norma Bates is gonna get what she asked for. 40 bars of Norma Bates. You know what I'm saying? Okay, 40 That's bars of Norma Bates. Now, you know, okay. Norma Bates ain't no lightweight, man. She ain't nothing to play with. She got that performance in them bars. No, I respect Norma. She's aggressive and all that. And everybody knows I'm a lot more laid back. But um, I'm going to bring a different 40 to the ring. I'm not going to be cool, calm, collected. And Norma's on her, you know, goon up and all that crazy shit. So we're going to see. The fans are going to see another side of me that um, I haven't really had an opportunity to show up until now. Because, you know what I'm saying? I approach every battle with... I try to match the aggression of my opponent. Like, Star's not really a in your face opponent. Even my ex wasn't really an in your face opponent, so it really wasn't no need for all that. But Norma, definitely not gonna let her fucking bow got me on camera any time for that matter. So, it's gonna be crazy. Do you feel like a couple of battles down the line that you are gonna be queen of the ring? Like, you know, heavy top tier? Hell yeah. Like, if I wasn't so humble right now, I'd say I'm definitely queen of the ring right now. 
I know my boss is there. It's just um, the work I gotta put in. You know what I'm saying? A couple more battles under my belt. I know what time it is. Everybody else is gonna know what time it is too. Slump your fam, swipe a life, hit a bitch's kid tonight. My niggas will kill for them Franklins and Lil Bills. <laughs> You want to shout out anybody who, who you think you want to take on? If we do bring Queen of the Ring to boss, I mean, not if, but we are, but you know, who you feel like you want in that ring? Farrah Funeral. Anybody else can get it too, but Farrah, that's all. Yikes. Yikes. Uh, you playing with fire, man. First Norman, now Farrah, you, you got confidence like that? Yeah, of course, and um, that's why I'm going to buy my time. I'm gonna do what I gotta do, all of the, the little steps, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna climb the ladder. But I'm not coming here to lose. Nebo, you know I told ya. I get it in anywhere. This sister's a soldier. Tryouts is in November, I'm gonna kill them all by March. It's gonna be the coldest winter ever. Turn Queen of Ring to the ice box. I plan to shock the whole league, from the artists to the faculty. I came here well prepared to exercise my strategy. Pounds on my hip and I ain't talking about a calorie. I'll lead this bitch stretch, let my balls cause the casualties. This is a question I'm asking all the girls. How do you feel like what, what Queen of the Ring is doing for the ladies? Pretty much what it's done for you so far. You know, as far as exposure and just getting out there. Like, where do you see it going? Queen of the Ring has definitely um, elevated my fan base crazy. Like, from when my spar session battle dropped to when Watch the Throne drop, like, my followers on Twitter started going crazy. I was getting um, a lot more hits on a couple um, of my personal, like, you know, my tracks and stuff that I got up on YouTube and shit. So, Queen of the Rings definitely been helping as far as, um, like I said, it's an excellent platform for getting females out there and things like that. I don't want to be known as a battle rapper, but um, they know me in this battle shit. So, right now, um, I was showing Devo around a little bit. Um, just kill a little time before I go pick up the homie Bogey so that um, we can go check out a couple gyms and um, speak to these people about um, getting this queen of the ring down here in Boston. Oh, shit. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We need okay. that down here. Yo. What's good? It's your boy Bogey, Shark Tank Battlegrounds, Raw Time Radio. Shout out Queen of the Ring, rep the brand. What's going on, Debo? What's going on, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. Voice of Boston, man. Let's get it, man. What we doing out here, man? Uh, we looking at a venues to uh, hold a Queen of the Ring event out here. We got 40 chauffeuring us around. 40. 40. <laughs> <laughs> you got top five? <laughs> including yourself? I won't include myself. I won't include myself. I won't even include myself. I don't got no top five. You ain't got a top five? Okay, that's what it is. Um, I'll give you the people I, who get the most of my respect. Who you, who you have respect for in the game right now? And it's battle shit. Shane Ashley, no question. E Hart, no question. Tori Doe, I love you, no question. Um, QB, my sis, no question. Um, precise, precise. I mean, honestly, I don't want to keep naming mad people because everybody else got their own thing. Not for real, because you know, I, mean, I don't want to take that away from nobody. But as far as like people who I make it a point to check for or um, the people that I want to check for me, definitely be. Okay, that's what it is. That's what it is. Any, any, anything else you want to say before these cameras go off, man? I really don't fuck with the camera like that. Besides, we know that, man. <laughs> we know that. This is probably the first interview ever uh, in a long time. Y'all be getting thrown, nigga. When they be want me to battle, I mean, 
interview and shit. I was like, oh, I'll see you later. Hold on one second. Deuces. What you gotta say? What you gotta say to um to Boston, man? Like you know, look directly in this camera and tell Boston what it is, man. How you how how you about to lay it down? Boston every time is y'all see me in grind time. Now y'all see me on Queen the Ring. I'm here repping the brand Queen the Ring. Y'all know what time it is. I got this. I got this. When Queen of the Ring comes here, I'm gonna show the city for everybody who can't make it out to New York. I'm gonna show everybody. What I do, especially in my time. I'm gonna be ready. Fair, get with me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> get with me. That's what it is. Forty bars signing off, huh? Bars, bitch. <laughs> Everyday life. I'm forty bars. This giant bone jet when I blitz in her end zone. I move like a patriot. They loving me, you hating it. I came to your state for the win, bitch. I'm taking it. Oh!